We'll guide you through how to download and install Optifine on Minecraft on your Mac. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. First of all, you need to go and close off Minecraft. And now what you need to do is go and make sure you've got Java installed. Basically, you need Java to go and install and run Optifine. So go and open up Safari and then all you want to do is go and search for Java just like so and go to java.com. Thanks to Apex Hosting for sponsoring this video. They're my go-to Minecraft server host. They've got so many awesome features like 24-7 servers and support so you can get help anytime you need it. Instant setup, one-click mod packs, ultra latency and so many more benefits. We'll put a link down below in the description and in the pinned comment. And at the moment you can get 25% off your first invoice. So go and check them out. Then go and click on download Java and scroll down and make sure you click on download Java for Mac. It should detect that you're using a Mac. And now if we go and look in our downloads, it's now downloading. Once it's finished downloading, then all you need to do is go and double click on it like this. Alternatively, you can just open up your finder and go and find the Java installer there and you can go and get it that way. So I'll now go and double click on Java. I've then had this pop up here. I'm sure I want to open it and say if it's from java.com and then we'll go and get this. So make sure you agree to this here. I already do and I've read it before. So I press install and you will then need to go and enter in your password like this and the install process will now go and run. Click on your search bar and you want to go and actually search for Optifine just like so and then go to optifine.net. Now at the top, go and click on downloads and you can see the different versions available. You can click on show all versions as well. So find the version you wish to go and get. Personally, I just like to go and get the fully released one. In this case, it's for Minecraft 1.20.1. So I'll then go and click on download like so. Now you are gonna be taken to an add wall. So just beware if there's any download buttons here, this isn't for Optifine, it's for the add. You want to click on the skip button in the top right and you'll then be taken to the download page. And then you can go and click on download just here and the download should now go and happen. And then what you can do is close out of your browser and we can go and open up our finder and go to the downloads. Here we are in my downloads and Optifine is at the top here. So then what we can do is go and double click on it like so. And you may then go and get this pop up here. If you do, then all you need to do is click OK, it's fine. And you'll get and may get another pop up. You need to go and open up your system settings. So I just opened up mine from the dock. You can go and search for yours in the top. Scroll down on the left here and go and click on privacy and security and then scroll down until you go and see this section here. It says Optifine was blocked from use because it's not from an identified developer. But I trust it, it's safe. I've used it before. I've never had a problem with it, but it's up to you. But to continue, you have to press open anyway and then enter your password, press unlock and then you can go and press on open to go and confirm your decision to go and run it. And you can then close everything off and Optifine should then go and pop up just like that. And it should go and find where Minecraft is and you can then go and press install and you may think nothing's happening, but don't worry, it sort of is happening, you just can't see it. And Optifine has now been successfully installed. So you can then go and press okay. And now we need to go and open up the Minecraft launcher. So you can go and search for yours or you know, however you open up Minecraft usually, go and do that. And from the launcher, you need to make sure we go and select Optifine, otherwise it won't be used when, we're, when we launch it. So go to the left, the play button, and you need to make sure you select Optifine, just like that. And then you can go and click on play. You need to understand that you're using a modified version because um, Optifine is like a modified version of Minecraft, but it's completely fine and it's now gonna go and launch. It's now gonna launch, and when we go and click on options and then video settings, you can see in the bottom left, we're using Optifine. And Optifine gives you so much more customizability. For example, in video settings, you're gonna see there's a load more options. You get things like shaders, you can then go into specific details and change them, and animations as well. So if you're trying to improve your frame rate and yeah, things like that, it's super useful. And so here we are in the world, and another awesome feature of Optifine is the zoom feature. So press C on your keyboard and you can then go and zoom in. So yeah, another useful feature. But I hope you guys found this useful. If you did, please consider subscribing and liking the video.